Hello, Rooster Dad 50 here. Just uh, making a long awaited video here that I've been <laughs> too busy to do for quite some time. I just wanted to uh, give an update on my shop, uh, which I was taking over from a, uh, an old uh, stable. And uh, not much to look at from the outside, uh, but uh, not much to look at from the inside either. So, <laughs> but I thought I'd just go ahead and give you the, the lowdown on that. Looking up at the North 40 here, there's Nugget. Always Nugget running around. See him behind the fence. <laughs> well, anyways, yeah, this used to be a stable here. And uh, all that stuff tarped there is just the stuff that was inside till we can get rid of it or do whatever we need to do with it. But obviously, a lot of work needs to be done to the outside. <laughs> horses kind of beat the heck out of it but here it is you recognize all the same stuff from my old shop you know that I managed to bring to California with at stereo the other day I picked it up for five bucks at the thrift store they threw in the speakers for free I thought that was pretty nice So got my little work area here, files and stuff like that. And the rest is abrasives, the the, the uh, vacuum pump and all that. But uh, a little welding area there. That's I know it doesn't look like it, but that's steel. <laughs> I got to clean that all up yet. Yeah, it's this has all been in storage for months now. So, plasma cutter, get stick welder down there. I don't have 220 out here, but uh, when I get my, uh, what do you call it, generator down here, then I'll go ahead and have that. MIG welder, that is a 110, so it'll work. Uh, a little place to hang my belts, and there's the center of attention there, the... Uh, uh, grinder for doing knife blades. Now hopefully I can get myself back into that again. It's been so long since I've had anything to do with it and it's kind of embarrassing. I would use an excuse but there's guys that uh, have one little uh, sander like that one up there and can use a little crawl space in, in, a, in a closet and come up with beautiful knives, so I really have no excuse <laughs> whatsoever. I've had to leave my uh, uh, forge at home, but I do have a gas one that, uh, or a propane one down in the box there that I'll be getting set up. I'll get all that set up in this breezeway right here. Got to clean all that crap out of there yet. But, yeah, I got some more hammers and tools and whatnot there. But so far, this is this is it. Now I got uh, electricity coming in from the top. That was a chore yesterday. Went and brought in uh, electricity from the backyard. Let's see if you can see the view from back here. It's kind of a neat view back here. I really like it. It's pleasant, peaceful. And this is the uh, the North 40 over this way. It's got a few things to get rid of and clean up and all that. But uh, and there's Ellie Mae. I want to tell you what she's looking for. There's cats nearby. So anyway, there's Nugget. It's a beautiful area. I'm very pleased to be here shed we put up a couple months ago. Anyway, this is just the backyard here. But uh, I'll have some more projects getting posted pretty soon as I figure out what the heck I'm doing. And until then, see you later. Rooster Dad out. <laughs>